Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. As you guys can see from the title, today's video is going to be a fall decorate with me. And yes, you guys have already seen how I decorated inside of my house. I did do a fall home tour. If you guys have not already seen that video, I will link it down below just in case you are interested in seeing that. But this time around, I decorated a little bit outside of my house. Now the front of my house, like my porch area, it's not large at all. It is extremely small. I really do wish it was larger because I would like to decorate more. I would have loved to put like chairs and a table out there and just more decor, but it is super small. So I only stuck with a few fall decor items. I did not want it to look cluttered, but I really do love the way it turned out. So I decided to take you guys along with me and show you guys where I placed everything and how I decorated. Most of the things that I decorated the porch with was stuff from Dollar Tree. I bought the haystack from Walmart. I believe it was like seven or eight dollars. And then everything else was pretty much from Dollar Tree other than the pumpkin as well. I just bought the pumpkin from my local grocery store. So I love the way it turned out. Like I said, not anything extravagant, not a lot, very small porch. But I just thought that you guys might like me taking you guys along with me and showing you guys how I decorated my porch because I know a lot of you guys did enjoy my fall home tour. So let's just jump right into how I decorated my porch for this fall. Okay guys, so here I am just unpacking my little hay sack that I purchased from Walmart. It was super affordable. I don't remember exactly how much it was, but I believe it was like under $10. Now I've never decorated using a hay stack or hay barrel. I don't know why, because I've always loved them and thought they were pretty. I've just never used it. So this year is the first year that I decided to purchase one. And I'm so glad I did because it turned out super cute. But here I am just messing around with the sign and everything, trying to figure out how I want to position things and where I want them. I really do wish that my porch was a little bit bigger. It is super tiny and small. So I only have maybe like two things on my porch to decorate because I don't want to put too much and make it look cluttered. So that is why I did not decorate a lot, but I just wanted to add a little touch of fall to my porch. Like I said, if it was bigger, I would definitely put out chairs and a little table and stuff like that. Like that but it is not although I did find a way to squeeze this hay barrel in that corner that corner is smaller than what it looks but I was able to make it work and here I am just placing some of these Dollar Tree garland around on my haystack you guys definitely need to go to your local Dollar Tree they have so many great fall craft DIY ideas supplies so definitely run out to your local Dollar Tree, see if they have anything left. They are starting to run really low. And then here I am trying to figure out where to put my fall DIY sign that I did do a video on. If you have not watched it, I will link that down below. And this is the end result of how my porch is looking for fall. Like I said, it is super tiny, so I couldn't do anything too crazy. But here I have my fall wreath that I did also make in a DIY. If you have not watched that, I will also link that down below. Then here in the corner, I have my Hello Fall DIY sign that actually turned out super cute, although it didn't turn out as expected. I still really love it, and it fits perfect in this little corner. And then over here on the opposite side, I have this little haystack with a pumpkin and then some garland. I also have a scarecrow and then this welcome to our patch sign. 
design. I love the way it turns out. I think it looks so cute and it definitely adds a nice touch of fall to my porch. So this is gonna end my decorate with me for my porch. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please remember to give my video a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, remember to subscribe to my channel, join me and my YouTube family, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks so much for watching.